Max isn't here yet? Well, now, Adriana, I'm uh, sure... Oh, you do realize that the uh, ceremony is scheduled to begin very shortly. Yes. Then where is he? Well, I... He's probably on his way. I left him a couple of messages on his voicemail. You mean he isn't even answering his cell phone? Well, I don't... You know what? He's getting married today, Dorian. Maybe he left it at home. The guy's nervous. Oh. So he's gotten cold feet? He didn't say that. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go check. And if I hear anything at all, I'm going to come right back and I'll let you know. All right? Hey, Adriana. Remember, you are marrying a man who has never been on time for anything in his life. Rex isn't here because he's with her. You know the reason he isn't here? He's with Gigi. I don't know that and neither do you. Then why is he late for his own wedding? I'm going to go find out what's going on. What am I supposed to do now? The first thing you need to do is calm down. How am I supposed to do that? If Rex is with Gigi, then you heard Bo. Uh, Rex is probably on his way over here now. I'm going to go to the church office and see if he called there. What you need to do is just keep taking deep breaths. What about Brody? I told you I talked to him. I paid him a lot of money to show up here and get back together with Gigi. Is he coming or not? Darling, I swear to you, I did everything I could to induce him to do the right thing. I even doubled the ante for him. Whatever it was that Adriana wanted you to do, I'm prepared to pay you double not to do it. So you think you got through to him? Oh, I'm almost certain I did. No text, no message? Nada. Bo, this is unacceptable. What the hell's wrong with this guy? It's his wedding day. But we don't know for sure why he isn't here yet. Well, I'll tell you what. If he's been in an accident, it better be a serious one because cuts and bruises aren't going to do it for me. Yeah, he better show up in crutches. All right, look, I know that Balsam doesn't always play everything by the book, but there's no way he would ever hurt Adriana. So, uh, Rex is walking away from this marriage. Nobody said that, Dorian. Then where is he, Bo? Antonio, Christian? We don't know. Fine. You know, if Rex were planning to marry Adriana today, he would have been here an hour ago. The, the ceremony was supposed to have started right now. I know that. I think it's best, man. You should prepare your announcement. What announcement are you talking about? This wedding must be called off. Well, I just called the station, and the good news is Rex hasn't been in an accident or anything like that. If I were the bride and the groom wasn't here and wasn't dead, I would kill him myself. I'm sure that Rex has a very good reason for being late. Yeah. Well, if he talks his way out of this one, he should copyright his excuse. Is she here? I didn't see Gigi or Shane. I could have missed them. I didn't get a good look at everyone. Well, what about Brody? You don't even have a groom yet, and you're worried about him? I need Brody here if Gigi shows up. Unless she and Rex have already run off together. Stop talking that way. Rex didn't run off with anyone. Is Brody here or not? Dorian, nobody is going out there and announcing anything to those people until we hear from Balsam. So it's just fine that my daughter is suffering this humiliation. Hey, okay. Rex was not at Vicky's house. Bo, the longer you take to call off this fiasco, the greater damage will be done to my daughter's emotional state. Look, I am not calling off anything until I'm told to do so by Adriana or by Balsam. This is Rex Balsam we're talking about. It's not David. I'll leave you standing at the altar, Vickers. How dare you? That is... Sorry, I'm late. Where you been? Um, I had to help out a friend, but I'm here now. Well, this is splendid. I'm sure Adriana will be so relieved. Well, then I guess we'd better go get everybody back in our seats. Everybody was starting to worry that you might not show up. 
Do they have a reason that they should start worrying? Darling, Rex is here. Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Where was he? According to Rex, he was doing some sort of heroic good deed. He's here now. That's all that matters. We'd better get out there, ladies. Yeah. Was he with Gigi? He didn't say. Well, he's here now. And that's all that matters. To marry me. I'm gonna be Mrs. Rex Balsam. There's... nothing to worry about. So, what are we waiting for? Let's get this wedding in gear, huh? <laughs> How do I look? Breathtaking. I'm sorry. For what? I haven't treated you very well lately. It's true, you haven't. But you came through for me when I needed you. I never thought you'd buy into the idea of Rex and me getting married. <laughs> what have I always told you? That all you want is for me to be happy. I didn't believe that a lot of the time, but... Now, with this wedding that you've given us, I know it's true. I love you. Oh, please stop. <laughs> You're gonna make my mascara run. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, I'd better go check, make sure everything's absolutely perfect. 